Hello everyone, my name is Shamira, aka Mimi. If you are new, welcome to my channel. If you're returning, welcome back. Now, you guys, today's video is for the zodiac sign of Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Okay, so you guys, this video will be on what are you currently hailing? And I did get a channel song, okay? And that song for you, Scorpio, is Distance, all right? That's by the singer, the rapper, Bora, okay? Now, um, I will leave the link below this video to that uh, song with the lyrics, okay? So you guys can check it out. And you guys, I pulled from the Hill Yourself deck and I got Selling Out, okay? And that is one, okay? One is about new beginnings, all right? So for you guys, I am getting that... Some of you are getting to something, and I would definitely say uh, a relationship, okay? Some of you might feel like, uh, of course, Scorpios are famous for keeping secrets, all right? But some of you guys aren't really sure if you should share your emotions, okay, and open up so freely uh, to this new situation, to this new person, okay? Not all of you are in a relationship, okay? So some of you are definitely going into... Um, I would say a new venture, okay? And you're not sure if you should trust it, okay? You guys are having a hard time trusting things. So you are definitely healing that within yourself, okay? Learning how to build trust, not only with yourself, okay? But with the people around you, all right? Because sometimes when we don't trust people, we sometimes, you know, reflect because we don't really trust ourselves, okay? We don't really trust ourselves to, uh, you know discernment okay whether something's good for us or whether something is going to harm us all right and that's basically what i'm feeling for, for you guys okay scorpio yes i'm seeing that some of you guys are definitely having a hard time trusting your intuition okay when it comes to opening up to this certain person all right because i'm definitely saying it, it has something to do with a relationship all right you like, um, I'm so into this person, but because of my last situation or because of my past experiences, I'm not really sure if I should just open up because I feel like I'm just selling out, you know? I don't want to look like a sucker, all right? <laughs> okay, because Scorpio girls can definitely... Uh, like I said, they are used to keeping secrets and they hate people keeping secrets from them because they know how sometimes devious, okay? And um, vindictive, they can kind of be when they get in their bad side, you know? So they think that, you know, um, if I'm like this on my bad day, just imagine how another person is, you know? I don't trust that person, you know? I don't really know if I should, uh, you know, open up too much or get too close. And sometimes it can be a little self-sabotage, you know, okay, Scorpio? So, yeah, keep working on that, okay? Trusting and building that trust with yourself and your own intuition, all right? So you can uh, slowly learn how to trust others, okay, freely, especially when it comes to new relationships because everyone is not going to hurt you, all right? That past relationship and situation is in the past, all right? Learn from those situations, okay? Learn from those situations and um, that will definitely get you to... Uh, you know, it, it will actually be some type of wisdom, you know, past situations, past circumstances uh, will, are, are definitely going to help you, okay, and guide you into new ones, all right? So definitely look out for the red flags in not every, I would say this, not every negative reaction from any person, okay, during a bad argument is going to be a red flag, okay? It, it depends on our perception and how we look at things. So if you always look at an argument as being um, someone attacking you, okay, or uh, a red flag, then that relationship is, is, is you know, is, is doomed, okay? It's doomed. It's going to be doomed, all right? It's going to fail if that's the way your, you know, your mind is. So, yeah, keep your thoughts a little pur, okay? Definitely trust your intuition, okay? Don't I will say this. Don't judge things or people based on um, your current, uh, you know, feelings and emotions, okay? Because sometimes we get a little upset or in our feelings or hurt. Um, we can get a little vindictive, okay? Okay, Scorpio, you can get a little upset and, and really angry, okay? Resentful. And you're only focused on... Um, that emotion of the moment, okay? So definitely when you guys are getting into these new relationships and you guys run into a roadblock, okay? Or a negative aspect of a person or the, the situation, you know, in the relationship, um, 
make sure you guys are soaking in, okay, all the information around you before you make a decision, all right? Never make a decision in the heat of the moment, all right? So definitely, I would say calm down, keep calm, all right? Think before you act, think before you speak, okay? And I'm telling you, um, you'll definitely uh, build that intuition, all right? Effortlessly, okay. Uh -oh. Too many fell out, but one flipped over, okay. And the one that flipped over, you guys, because you guys saw me shuffle this deck, right? The one flipped over was trust, okay. What did I just say? You're learning to trust your intuition, okay. And some of you, I'm feeling like this new relationship that you, you guys are dealing, um, you, you guys are delving into. Um, you're not going to be a sellout. Don't look at it uh, as you being a sucker, you know, or you're, you're uh, because you are opening up or sharing that intimate moments or intimacy with your with your new person. Like I said, whatever happened in the past, okay, that's the past. Definitely use those those things as lessons, okay, as a lesson of what to look out for, what not to do, okay. But don't go into a new relationship or a new um, endeavor or opportunity with that same mind frame that, oh my gosh, it's going to fail because it's not. Like I said, trust your feelings, your, your gut instinct, okay? Trust your intuition, all right? Trust your intuition with these things. And I, I swear things will turn out um, in a different light. Don't, don't self-sabotage yourself, okay? You're not a sellout. So definitely, you guys, you are working through trusting yourself and your intuition. And I love that. Okay, Scorpio, leap into the unknown, have faith, <clears throat> excuse me, move forward and believe you will fly. Yeah, yeah, you guys, and because I'm like <clears throat> flaring my throat, yes, you guys are definitely uh, like holding back on expressing your feelings and emotions to a certain someone, okay, uh, a new person, all right, and all I'm, I'm just telling you right now, maybe you just need to just say it. Speak your feelings, speak your emotions. You never know how it's going to turn out. Maybe the person feels the same way you do, okay? So don't think that you're you're a sucker, okay? <laughs> okay, Scorpio, because I know a lot of you are like, nah, I'm not weak. I'm also looking at you like that, but you, okay? Okay, so yeah. Yeah, yeah. Trust your intuition. Say what you mean, mean what you say, okay? You guys, I'm going to pull from the crystal deck to get a crystal that can help you through this healing uh, time to help you heal this issue, okay? Yes. The Scorpio. Okay. I got one. And that is Lemurian Quartz, okay? Yeah, that is uh, 31. 3 plus 1 is 4. And 4 numerologies are all about, um, you know... A stability and foundations, all right? You're feeling a little emotionally uh, unstable right now. Spirit is definitely calling for you to just uh, have faith, all right? Don't overthink things. Clear your mind, okay? Because when I look at the Sumerian Quartz, it's definitely, I definitely see uh, a little bit of, you know, indigos, all right? I don't know if you guys can, can see it. It's a, a little bit in the back. And I'm seeing that uh, yellows too, the solar plexus. So yeah, have faith in not only a uh, higher power in, in, in yourself, okay, have faith within you, yourself, all right? Trust that you will make the right decision and things will turn out. And like I said, this doesn't necessarily have to do with a relationship or a partnership because it could have something to do with a uh, any new beginning in your life, okay? You're not quite sure how it's going to turn out. Um, go in it with the open mind, okay? And I do see the full, the full energy, all right? Okay? You're, you're not a sucker if you fall in love, all right? If you're in love with this new person, let them know, okay? Don't hold yourself back. Have that confidence, okay? Trust yourself and just do it, okay? Just go for it. I'm definitely seeing that. But definitely, guys, if you're a little scared, you still have a little difficulty in doing that, um, meditate, okay? Pray. 
because it always works. Believe me, it always works, okay? So yes, you guys. Yes, Scorpio. Yeah, keep the faith, baby. And um, if you guys like this video, hit the like button, okay? And if you like to share it with your fellow Scorps, okay? Share it. If you guys want to uh, leave some feedback, it is definitely welcome, okay? And also subscribe, okay, you guys, for more videos like this one. Plus, pick a card because I will be doing some of those, so stay tuned. And, um, yeah, you guys, if you want a personal reading, please visit the description box below because I do have all the information down there, okay? And if you guys are interested in purchasing any crystals, okay, healing crystals or any chakra braces like these to keep you balanced, all right, please. Please visit my spiritual shop and that is heavenly, heavenly by goddess be. All right. I will leave everything in the description box below. Okay. So you guys have a beautiful, beautiful, wonderful day. All right. I score it.